welcome back to the channel and welcome back to this week's trial I'm using the Mercedes-Benz C63 and yeah not driving cars this time but just doing dug nuts for the heck of it this week's trial all for one we're using super saloons for this event i like seeing the 2021 bmw uh, i think it's the m4 competition competition sedan i like seeing that car in the races i like using it i like the way it sounds but let's face it if you have a car like the c63 that you can comfortably own people and win races with um, regardless of the fact that this at this corner was a surprise to me that this is a um, a mixed surface race i did not expect that because i didn't see like what the race was about or anything like that i just jumped in picked this car otherwise i would have used um this jaguar i have specifically for off-road racing it's also one of the cars i could have picked and i was thinking i could either be fast in one of two places either on tarmac but i know for a fact i won't be fast enough on the dirt because i'm using real tires but sport suspension so i doubt i would have been any good so the only other fact i had was just me being good at enough to be in front to let me just happen but the guy grom 7035 he was actually not that far off and i was actually hoping to have a nice close race with him either him kind of just beating me down because i think in the corn in the on tarmac i would have been faster than on like on the third sections he would have been faster it was my initial idea but i think at the end especially like when he gets close to me um because I try not to drift the car as much around corners because I know that will just slow me down way too much and keeping the car just straight as much straight as possible in corners to, to not get like Lisbon especially uh, just to gain that traction a bit to just drive away I think those bits is where I kind of just kept my lead because there's like one more corner left and um, the closest he's been was just to hover over my underneath my bubble my bubble on the map was just almost covering me yeah that's a beautiful looking car and it's good to see it's one of the um, bmws now for the second race of the event with the river scramble i hardly mention some of the races tracks names mainly because it's kind of difficult for me to pronounce some mexican names or the mexican track names areas and stuff like that so instead of mispronouncing it i'm just gonna let it be like this track actually had me worried because Grom was taking the lead comfortably and on a point system we are off the points behind so I was thinking to myself oh nice this is gonna be one of the few times for the last few months that I've been back into the trial that we would uh, get like a third race because at the end of the day let's face it one of the reasons this game is still 
I've been running for the amount of time in my opinion is the fact that we have like a weekly thing to do and I personally don't want that to stop because it's a very very nice like thing to get into the game and Chrome sorry bruh you missed it checkpoint so now I can now it's just a wash for him I can just cruise now until the end of the race because we have less than half of the points needed to actually win this event as a team and I don't know what to make of that seriously but anyway I do feel that the festival for me is like the biggest draw towards the game after you've done almost everything yeah you get to participate in the trial which is essentially a forced team event um, and you get like all walks of life you get weird ones good ones trolls you get like pro drivers um, and I've ran into a couple of them this month alone and at the end of the day that's what the trial is about Grom's back up to second but um, we still don't have enough points to get uh, the next to get the win <coughs> so yeah at the end of the day if they stop the trial I'd I highly doubt that I would come back but I was thinking also if they from this point onward just said nah screw it we're gonna recycle um, all the trial events from the beginning of the game I still would play it if there's other people doing it but it's not like in Horizon 4 where if you wanted to do like a co-op event you would send out like a co-op request kind of a thing oh I made a fucky wacky yeah and you make a co-op request to play with people on the last day to help them like finish their festival stuff and I actually enjoy doing that um, because if you see someone um, the last day for the when the new event rolls through and I just happen to be online I, would, I used to just you know like jump in accept the invite and help those people like finish up the thing because the co-op thingy if there's some beta players in the lobby with you yeah and they help you you still get the win at the end of the day you get the points and you get to go through and I used to think that that was actually very nice and that's something you don't get to do here in um, Horizon 5 now because if no one else is doing a co-op thingy with you you are just like matchmaking with other people that you have to go look for at the end of the day but that's my that's my only bad take I think for now and as per usual, like, comment, subscribe. This was the weekly trial um, on Mix Surface and it was kind of fun. And I'll see you guys with some more Forza Horizon content. And the victory down at didn't go as planned because I'm all over the place. Have a lekker day. I'll see you guys with some more Forza content soon. Bye.